In today's video, I go over how to install Mumble, how to download Valheim specific positional audio files, and how to launch Valheim with those files enabled. Thanks to Reddit user Jachase, positional audio is now available for Valheim. So for anyone who doesn't know what positional audio is, let me explain. Positional audio is a feature of Mumble that places players around you depending on their actual location. For instance, if someone is in front of me in game, I will hear their voice in front of me. If they are on my left, I will hear them on my left. If they are on my right, I will hear them on my right. This way you can hear the person as if their in-game avatar was right next to you. Um, not very. You could, uh, do you have the, uh, do you have a troll cave that you haven't been in yet? Uh, not near me, no. Usually he's around here. The farther you are away from that player, the lower their voice will get. So now the reason why you guys are here, let's set up Mumble. So the first thing you're going to do is open up the Mumble webpage. So I'm in mumble.com support. And then the Mumble server install on Windows. If you just type in download Mumble, you'll get to this page as well. You can follow this page to a T, but I will go over it with you guys. So we start out with this Mumble setup wizard. Press next. Read your terms and conditions because we know we all do. Accept. Next. All right, this is where we're going to, um, what features we want to install. So you've got a client and a server. Only thing you need to worry about is if you want to install it to a different drive. So right now I have mine on the C drive. Um, if you want to change it, you can. You just go browse and then change that. I'm going to keep it how it is. Next. Now this is ready to install. This is where we're going to begin our install. All right, now that we're done with that, we're going to finish and it should open up. So the first thing you're going to encounter is this Mumble Server Connect. This is where you're going to find your servers that you can connect with. For now, we're going to leave that alone. So let's just cancel out of that. So the next thing we're going to bring up is this Mumble homepage. Inside of the settings menu, I'm going to make sure that my mic is selected. Right now I have it set to default device and I know it's working because I can see this, this bar filling up. The rest of the stuff can be left alone. Let's go to audio output. In audio output, you're going to select your headphones and uh, you can just select, if you're going to be using your speakers, use your speakers. If you're going to use your headphones, put those. That's what you're going to put there. I have mine set to default because I have my uh, Windows settings correct. Turn on positional audio. You're going to need this later on. Leave volume, zero, jitter buffer, 10. These are just the default um, settings. Just keep them the same. Output delay, keep it at 50 milliseconds. Uh, positional audio, make sure heading headphones are selected. Minimum distance, leave that at one. Bloom, let's set to 150. And then your minimum distance set to 50 meters. That should be it for this. Now let's go down to plugins. In the plugins, make sure this option link to game and transmit position is enabled. Also, if your game is selectable here, make sure everything is enabled. So if your game is here, make sure there's a little check mark next to it. After that, let's hit OK. And on those games, your game doesn't have to be in there to work. You just have to have a specific code, which is what we're downloading next. So right now, Mumble is set up for us. So now it's time to download the Valheim specific positional audio files. So again, thanks to Reddit user Jachase, we now have the file that we need for Valheim to work. It will take you to this page. This page is in the description below. So if you need that link, it's in the description below. So this is the Valheim positional audio files. If you go down, it'll tell you exactly how to install. If you're doing separate packages, you can do these other ones, but we're going to start at the all-in-one package. So we're going to go get the all-in-one package from the releases. So we're going to click releases. That's going to take us to this page right here. We're going to go um, stay on the top version because we want the latest version of this. We're going to go down to the all-in-one under packages. Now that that's downloading in the bottom left-hand corner, after it's done downloading, let's just open it. That's going to bring up our file explorer. You will then take all these files and copy them. Next step is to put them inside of your Valheim directory. So the best way to do this is to first figure out where you store your Steam games. 
Um, I store mine on my C drive. Program files x86 is what we're looking for. Go down to Steam and then go down to Steam apps. This will, oh, and then one more, go into common. This will pull up all your Steam games that you currently have saved on that drive. Double click on your game, Valheim. And then this is all the files. I've already put them in here, but this is where you would copy and paste. But I have them in from whenever I tested this before this video. One thing I forgot to mention is that you're gonna need to join a server. So to do that, you'd press server and then connect. This would bring up your server connect menu. You can choose a server by adding new and then uh, making your own, but I believe that only works for about a day. Um, you need to go to the public internet and then pick your area. So I'm in the North America, United States. And you can choose any of these servers um, and find kind of an empty room where you and your friends could join. Um, just to test it, I chose this voice packet, uh, free temp server US West. As far as I know, it'll let you stay on there for um, at least a day. You can have fun with your friends and then join the server again the next day. So that's what I use. That's what you can use, but uh, that's that. Now that those are in, all you have to do is launch the game. So you can launch it from here or you can launch it from your normal way. I'm just gonna launch it from here. We're gonna pull up Valheim. And just so you guys know, this is it. We're done. I'm just showing you what it's gonna look like. So you're gonna have this this uh, program that pops up, the BEP NX program. Um, it's gonna give you some background information for what your game's doing. Um, and then your actual game's gonna pop up as well. And that's it. Valheim is open, it is installed. Your next step is to share this video with your friends that are on your server and you can get started with that. Note that everybody that wants to have positional audio needs to have everything that we went over in this video. If they don't want to have positional reference audio, they don't have to. They're just not going to be able to participate in positional reference audio. So thank you guys for watching. I know this was a hot topic. I was looking for it myself and I'm glad I figured it out. Um, again, thank you for Reddit user Jichase for posting that. Um, let's give him all the credit. I just made the video. So if you liked the video and I helped you out, please hit that like and subscribe button and not miss out on future content. Um, I do stream on YouTube. Uh, this game is starting to get popular on YouTube. Hopefully it gets more popular. There is some snapshots out for the game for the next year. So I do see this game actually kind of taking off. So um, thank you for watching and I'll see you soon. Peace.